Hello everyone and welcome to Quinnus' World 7. Um, you join me here, I have gone through the first uh, bit already because I'm not sure if that was streamable. I've tried to stream twice already and it crashed both times. Uh, there does seem to be a little issue. Uh, it says I have to buy either one of these first three cards apparently. Uh, just looking through them though, I am liking some of the cards here for sale, especially this one, I very much like that one, and this one. But um, we've got 20,000 credits, there's not much difference price wise between them, this one is quite a lot higher performance points, but I like a challenge, so I'm going to go with the lowest performance point, which is the Mazda Demio Touring. So let's purchase that. <coughs> this will... Well, that's not... Uh, okay. I take it I can't change the colour of it yet. Okay, collect points. I'm not too fussed about that. I see you paid first car, congratulations. This will be your first car, I just guessed that. Going to garage and checking out your new car. Yes, I will do. And this is the new menu folks. Garage is now open. Uh, I can't actually select any events or anything yet, so I take it this is something I have to do. It seems there, there could be an issue with loading times. You can also turn in tickets you get in races and receive bonus items as well. Okay. Uh, for those of you that do know, I did get the Collector's Edition, but I haven't redeemed any of the items because I don't want to make the game too easy. Um, Grand Turismo for me. Yes, I don't really care. Grand Turismo for me has always been more of a start with crap and work your way up sort of game. Uh, and I much prefer doing that, to be honest. You jump in the fastest car straight away, I just don't see... The challenge in that. Oh, I don't think that was something I had to do. Uh, car settings. Okay. You can actually just. I know, woman Christ oh my. Oh my god. Lots of uh, menus. Anti lag system. Wow. Okay. So there could be anti-lag, well there obviously is anti-lag in this game. ECUs. Nitrous, I saw that. Titanium connecting rods and piston shafts. Wow, there is a lot of stuff you can do in this game. Wow. That is um, certainly impressive. We'll uh, obviously look, wait to see how in-depth that goes. Cafe is now open. Again, something I have to do. I presume this is just going to show me through all all, all of the uh, whatever called areas. Cafe is shrouded in the woods, blah blah. I'm just going to skip all this. I really don't need to be walked through stuff is pretty self-explanatory. Special menu books. <laughs> I mean, come on, seriously. Yeah, so I have to collect all three of them, apparently. Might have one or two of them already. My god. I think I just skipped that. I didn't mean to.
There seems to be quite a lot of issues already, apparently, reported by the players. Let's have a look at this first. Oh, okay, it's just liveries and stuff. Okay, I'm not worried about that. Sagittarius has done literally all of them, apparently. So, I think you have to do a race first. Rather than doing some license tests and stuff. Um, I have no idea. Broad bean race, raceway, gift car, third place or higher. Uh, oh, okay. They seem to have overcomplicated this quite a lot. As you guys all know me, uh, as usual there will be no assists run. Uh, I have the difficulty uh, on the highest it can go, which is hard, which is two chilli peppers rather than three. Jesus Christ, that's loud. Wow, let me turn that down, that was ridiculously loud. Wow, my car suspension feels very strange. I don't know this track. Oh my god. There's a Mazda Atenza there. And a Prius. Uh, is the Prius going to pinch me? Whoa, that's a lot of understeer. I'm lacking the handling so far though. I haven't done any of the... Uh, there is another thing before you start the main game this AI is pretty easy it would seem even on the hardest difficulty yeah this AI is definitely way too easy completely standard car and we're, I know it's only two laps but I mean we're already in the lead It looks very pretty this game, although the chase camera is very far away from the car. A little bit strange. Doesn't look much different to sport. Uh, as you all know, I didn't particularly enjoy sport. It was not a Gran Turismo game in my opinion. That's a win. Something go up. Seven and a half grand, Jesus. Seems like a lot of money to get for one race. And we win a new car. Okay. I don't know how I leveled up. I'm pretty sure it said next target was 30 points and I've only got 29. Not bothered about replays. Not, not when we're not doing anything special, anyway. But, um, yeah, I don't know if I'm going to do, uh, is there only two races? Oh, there's a GT Cup there, which I can't enter yet, I don't think. Uh, yeah, I don't know if I'm going to stream every single time I play the game. Uh, I think possibly these first few times I play it, I'm going to, of course, stream. Get you guys into it, get, let you know what's uh, what's happening with the game. Oh dear, let me drop that. Yeah, hopefully they fix streaming it 
because as I said I tried to stream it twice both times as soon as I came back into the game after I started streaming the game crashed Which is a bit annoying. Okay, I hate, I hate driving in that view. Let's drive back in the interior view. I do like this this view. Oh my god. Oh my god. That's a lot of understeer. And again, a lot of understeer. A lot of turbo lag in this car. Jesus Christ. A lot of suspension moving as well there. I don't particularly remember these tracks. I'm sure I'll get used to them again. Seems to be a lot of suspension travel in these cars. Such dream, such dream, such dream. Now I'm pulled to the right. Early on the brakes. Oh wow. Oh wow. The suspension is really strange I don't know if it's more realistic you can see the car moving in very strange ways twitching up and down I don't know about that but if I just turn the wheel you can see the whole car twitching on the inside of the Prius I don't know what the aqua is it looks like a a Yaris of some sort, oh crap, a bit wide there. Was the Prius, is he still there or is he gone? No, he's gone, oh my god! I nearly ended him then. That was certainly a little bit quicker. I'm pretty sure that's a Yaris. Change up, use the boost. Use the boost from the turbo. Yeah! Late Derby. Oh my god, that might have been too late. He's gonna come back through. He's gonna come back through and win. No, maybe not. He should have done because that was a, a shocking line for me. If that was Grand Turismo 4, he'd have been back through and had lost. Why's it time to change down second? That's strange. Okay, so that's two wins in a row. Both of which were not difficult at all in the slightest. I win the Honda Jazz. That is Jazz. So I believe the Mazda 3, Honda Jazz and Toyota Yaris, I think. Obviously the Japanese versions. So they have different names. Uh, I wonder where the license tests are. Usually, like I really enjoyed the license tests. I thought it would be telling me to do them first. Let's go back to the cafe. Let's see what he gives me. Cause he said he'll give me a prize car or something. Yeah, cafe. I mean, the game's not slow, but I'm not keen on all these black screens. Succeed in getting all three cars, so, so this completes this collection. And boy, do I have some stories to tell you about these cars. Let's talk later. Roulette ticket, license sensor. There we go. Okay, let's see what this guy has to say. See what I mean? Another black screen. Ah, okay. It's literally just like a fucking... Da, 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 da. Why are they all got the hazards on? Menu book. Test yourself for lasting sensor. Yes, I will do that one because I do want to do that. Um. Usually, I try to get all golds in the licenses. I'm not sure if I'm going to do that just now. Because I don't particularly want to leave this first video just being a license test, if you know what I mean. I don't want to 
I'll just make you all watch that car collection. So if I just click this, is, is, is it going to do it itself or... No, it's going to say two constantly. Why does it do that, man? Yeah, very nice, yeah, very nice. Don't care. Gifts. Let's open that. I presume this will be like a standard gift that everyone gets straight away. I don't think it'll be random. Ooh. Give me the Alpine. Give me the Alpine. Please. I don't want money. It makes it too bloody easy. Oh, 10,000. Okay, that's not too bad. Only 10,000. I thought it was going to be something like 100,000 already. That's fine. I'll take 10,000. License center. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Oh my god, another black screen. Christ almighty. This is license center. This blah blah blah. I mean, I don't need to know these things. I appreciate some people may be new to the game, but it's it's pretty self-explanatory. Oh, one. Oh, okay, I can't click the other ones yet, but there's only five licenses. Ooh. Oh, wow, okay, I'm liking all these last five cars. High-speed ring, starting and stopping. I love how there's a trophy for all bronze and a, a trophy for all gold, but not one for all silver. Personally, I think they should have made it harder. Like in Gran Turismo 3 and 4. Where I... Yeah, I'm not going to go back to the good old days, but... It's, er it's early days. I've only been playing the game for 20 minutes. I can't decide whether or not I like it yet. Yes, okay, Christ almighty. All this just to tell me that I need to break in a straight line and... Gee, it's not hard. Like, there was an option at the beginning of the game asking me whether or not I had played Gran Turismo's before and I selected yes. So it should know that I don't need this information. Oh wow, that was way too late on the brakes for gold. Wait, what? How the hell was that gold? What? I did not expect that to be gold. I, I, I personally thought I stopped way too late. So that all my friends are ahead of me on that because I know full well that I stopped too late. Okay, how do I go on to the next one? Three grand? Really? I don't need all that money for... I can see myself getting frustrated. I shouldn't be, because it's very early in the game. I shouldn't be getting frustrated with it already. Oh my god, another black screen. This car's faster, yes, okay, right, I don't... Ooh, let's try not to get frustrated with it. This one I'm probably going to have to stop at the 100. Yes. 
so I need to be breaking about 75. Probably shouldn't be revving it out that high. Stop you. That's too late. Wow, the ABS really doesn't like it when you turn. That's nearly gold. If I get the launch. If I get the gold on the third try, I won't be too unhappy. Great. Now. There you go, that's gold. I'm not going to lie, it seems a little too easy. I'm, well, I'm fastest of everyone on my list there, apparently. That was not something that I expected. I don't know if Mr. May has done any of these yet. I presume he will have done, but... Not 100% because he was out last night. Oh man. Yeah, once again we're at uh, a black screen. It does seem a little bit long on the loading screens but I have to be honest bear in mind I am on the PS4 version because I am paying for a PS5 for one game basically leaving it second flat out and square off the corner that was the easiest goal I've ever achieved in my life that was a joke So I mean that was just not hard at all. That should not have been a gold, that should have been at the very most a bronze. It just it's infuriating me a little bit. It seems like it's just too easy. Obviously I haven't got into wet weather or anything like that yet, but I don't know if we will actually in this first bit. Let's see. This is obviously a quicker car, a TT. But it's also on better tyres. Four wheel driving understeers like crazy. Yeah. Okay, so second gear then. It's a V6. Do I use the grunt in third or do I hold it out in second? Shouldn't have been a gold. It should not have been a gold. So far off the apex. Man. I've got forty four grand already. I hate to say it, it's just a bit too easy.
I mean, they've been working on that Sophie AI. Granted, I haven't seen much of the AI yet, but I think it's just going to be way too easy. I really do. And let's let's first talk about the bloody size of this game. Mine so far is 140 gigabytes. That's before they had any updates. Okay, this should not be a gold. That was just shocking. If this is a gold, I'd be annoyed. Yeah, that's a gold. That is... I'm sorry, that's just pathetic. I could not have got that corner any more wrong. And it was a gold. Now that says one of two things. Either I am exceptionally good at this game already, which I am very highly doubting, or the game's too easy. I know they're trying to make it beginner friendly and helpful to all the players that play it, but it should not be like that. It shouldn't. People rant and rave saying that Gran Turismo 3 and 4 are the best Gran Turismo's. And it's not because that they're easy. Do you know what I mean? It's not because they're easy, it's the exact opposite. Whoa, bit of sliding going on there. Christ. This is the first car I've driven in it with any power. Wasn't ready for that sliding. Still gonna be third. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay. Maybe they've made it more difficult to drive in higher powered cars then. That was a good little slide there. I'm quite, I'm, okay, this has changed my mind a little bit. I'm quite enjoying driving this car. I'm hoping it's not just this car though. Wow. I don't think these things will slide that much in real life, I'm not gonna lie. It has to be third. It has to be. Fourth gear, really. Limit sliding. I think, again, that was a, a bit too easy. That was much more fun, though. Much more difficult to drive. But again, too easy. Jeez, I shouldn't be passing it that quickly. GR86RZ. Pretty sure that's a GT86, isn't it? Uh, Toyota. It's got, it's got to be that. GR maybe Gazoo Racing. Yeah, I bet you it is actually. I bet that's Gazoo Racing 86, isn't it? So this should be a little bit quicker than a normal 86. Oh, we're on Trial Mountain now. Okay, I've not driven Trial Mountain. All the other tracks so far have been standard tracks that were in sport. This one was not. B7 is all about braking. I don't know why I'm reading this. Oh, United States. Oh, sorry. That must be uh, where Trial Mountain is based. My apologies. This is a Toyota. Yeah, it is. Decide on a landmark to remind you to brake. Go ahead with no. That's nowhere near the apex. Oh, that's a wall. Yeah. So I need to break a little bit earlier than what I did. It probably is saying decide on the landmark on purpose. So I'm guessing it's the uh, sign on the right hand side as we go past it. Let's see it. Just there.
Lost of one is dear. It's gold. So, even though it's not first try, first completed run is gold. I'm hoping the next licenses are much harder then. And they've kept the daily workout as well, which isn't something I'm particularly keen on, I'm not going to lie. I hope it doesn't give me a car like it did on Gran Turismo Sport. Sport gave you a car every 26 miles or something like that. Which made the game incredibly annoying because you'd end up with five or six duplicate cars that you couldn't sell. Now if I can sell them, then I'm not too bothered because if I get like a million pound Ferrari, I will keep it. I won't use it. But I'll keep it because it's cool. But if I get something like a 10 grand Fiat that I've already got, then I'll just sell it. Oh my god. Oh my god. I did not want to stop. Try that again. It's an Evo 4. Yeah. Break it 100 meters then. Active your kicking in. Gold. I'm not gonna lie. It's, it's definitely, definitely, definitely too easy. And I've got 60 grand. I've, I've, I've done two races basically and I have 60 grand. The old Gran Turismo's, you never even got money for doing licenses, and this is the way it should be. You shouldn't be getting money for doing licenses. You should get the car at the end of it, and that's it. You shouldn't, you shouldn't be getting paid every single one you do, because I'm, I'm getting like three, four grand for every license, which is a bit stupid. I'm lacking this uh, Civic Type R Limited Edition. I'm gonna have to remember this is front wheel drive. Early on the brakes, closed it through, power out. Oh wow, that was a lot of turbo lag. Like. That's probably. Uh, maybe second. Had a lot to apply the brakes when the car is moving in a straight line. Why? It's not trail braking, is it? That is a lot of. Uh, So I'm getting a lot of uh, lag in third, and then I'm getting a lot of wheel spin in second. Why is it looking backwards? It does not like that curve. Nearly got gold. Get it on this front, hopefully. No, I'm not going to on this front. That was a lot of honest deer. Might as well just retry that, yeah? Okay, 
Yeah, so it's definitely quicker to leave in third through there because I don't have to deal with the gear change. Settles the car on these curves. Yeah, that's not good. I think that could be the camera angle, though. I never like driving in that camera angle. I'm gonna go back to cockpit view. Since it's yours, you know, they there, keep going. Cleo Trophy around Cuba. I didn't. Oh, yeah, I did actually. I got to drive Deep Forest, didn't I? In the. GR? No, no, I didn't. No, that was Trial Mountain. I don't think I got to drive Deep Forest there. I'm pretty sure that is, that is back in this game. I can't remember, you know, because I've purposely not been watching any videos on. It or anything, because I didn't want to spoil the hype for myself. Here's your final exam, pass the exam, blah blah blah. It looks like it's very easy to pass, judging by the right hand side, everyone is a long way quicker. Where are we? Turn, turn one. Oh wow, that's got shocking brakes. Yeah, this one's definitely not gold straight away. Wow, I can't believe it was that close to gold when I completely messed it up. Wow, nice understeer, that was full lock. Wow, wow. have failed when I didn't do anything then. Yeah, I did go off track, fair enough, can Turn in, car, turn in. On the power. actually finished. National B license acquired. Oh, 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 get a car. Get a car now, do I? What do I get? Ah. I get the Clio. Do I get to choose the colour? I'll 
take that as a no, I don't get to choose the colour. Oh, got another car. Oh, okay, that's a bit better. So that's because I got gold and old bronze, I guess. Level up. My name is Coque Lopez. Have you been using the auto braking feature? No. Why would I use auto braking? Let's go back to the cafe and see what this guy's saying. Blah 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 blah. Good wood. Ooh, brand hatch. Menu book. Okay, okay. Ah, I unlocked tracks, okay. Right, oh, used cars, didn't want to do that. Oh, it's updated already. Buy a mini with 5,000 miles or do I buy a mini with 49,000? For 6 grand less. Why is it saying Scirocco has a limited stock? What does that mean? Why is it limited to start? What does that mean? That says low mileage beetles and there's high mileage beetles. I don't like a beetle, I don't like 500. I've got 70 grand basically. That's 40, that's 60. Okay, so I can get two of them straight away. I didn't want to actually watch this, but yeah, take that. Yeah, very nice. Thank you. No, and I'll buy this. Thank you. Blah blah blah. I need. 32 grand for a golf. Uh, not golf, uh, What is it? Beetle, that's it. Right, I think, folks, that that is gonna pretty much do it for this uh, first sort of glimpse of Winchester 7. I am going to keep playing it off of the video. Um. So far, I'm not going to lie, I'm very indifferent to the game. Very indifferent to it so far. Uh, hopefully, that improves and I really start to like it because, you know, old Gran Turismo's were the love of my life back in there. So I'm really hoping that I get to like it a lot more. Um, but that's going to do it for this episode, folks. Hopefully... I will see you all in the next one. If you did enjoy this one, feel free to let me know in the comments or press that like button, whatever. Uh, but take care, folks. Enjoy the rest of your evening. Bye-bye.